Welcome to my How to Draw series, and today we're going to be drawing a cute bunny. So grab a piece of paper and colored pencil and follow along. So we're gonna start off with that head. Big circle because he's gonna have a big head, and then we're going to add a bean-like shaped body. So keep these lines light, as it will help when you draw over it with a black pencil. We draw the legs are kind of just tube-like protrusions on the bottom that are going to turn into these boxy looking things, which will be the paws. They look like boots at the beginning because you don't see where the toes are at first. And we draw two of them since the bunny has two feet. If you need to pause the video anytime, be sure to do so just to double check what I'm doing. And get those feet in there so we can move on to the shoulder area right after this. The shoulder is going to be a circle and then we're going to draw another tube coming out of that circle since it's going to be the bunny's arm. And then at the end of the bunny's arms, we're going to draw another circle for the palms. Just keep the shapes really basic. It makes it really easy to draw this way. And that way you're not concentrating on details to start with because we will do that later. And for the face, we're gonna divide it in half because we wanna know where we wanna put those eyes and the muzzle and where we want the face facing. And right now we want him facing more to the right. I'm gonna give him chubby cheeks because we he is a happy bunny. So let's give him some chubbier looking fingers, which are pretty much just circles. And then big eyes because we want a happy toony bunny, so just big ovals. And the nose and the mouth with a big smile. And we're gonna draw the mouth open because we want him very happy and we're gonna give him a buck tooth. And happy eyebrows and big ears. And between those big ears, we're going to draw a little bit of hair in the middle. You don't have to, but I just really like characters with a little bit of hair. And we'll draw his pupils and I wanted to draw them looking to the side, but you can draw them wherever you want because he's really excited. The tail is literally just a circle and that's it. And then just start going over it with the black. And that way we can make this bunny really pop. Just clean up your lines. If you did it on the iPad, then of course you can do it in a different layer. If you did it on a piece of paper, just go over it with a black pencil or pen. And we pretty much fill in all the details and you can see that the rabbit looks a lot cleaner after you pretty much covered over all the sketchy lines and um, brought out all the details. I give them a little bit of fluff when I go over them just to give the character more of like a puffier look. You don't have to do that, but I think it looks better. And that way we can divide the toes out as well so they don't just look like boots. And for the fingers, we make the chubby little fingers and divide out the palms since bunnies don't have paw pads so we don't have to draw them in and just a fluffy tail and we've divided the area for the stomach and that is pretty much it on this one we give him some big old whiskers so everybody knows there's a big bunny and some white spots and he is completed so thanks for watching